Hello everybody, Steve Main here, uh, getting ready to jump into Heroes of the Storm for uh, the Daily Storm. For those of you who are new to the series, basically I go into Heroes of the Storm and I play a daily quest. And my daily quest today is to play a specialist, so I'm playing Sylvanas. Um, sorry, didn't mean to do that. So uh, I'm going to click in here and start the game. I'm going to queue up, start the match, and once we uh, about to load in, I'll be right back. I'll see you folks in a sec. All right, everybody, we're back, and uh, game has begun here. Let's take a look at the teams. It's Lieutenant Morales, Arthas, Rexar, Sylvanas, and Gazlo versus Stitches, Tazadar, Abathur, Zagara, and Sonya. And uh, it looks like we are going to have a pretty beefy team. We've got uh, Rexar and Arthas, who are both tanks, although Rexar, Gazlo, and Sylvanas are really good at taking mercenary camps. Uh, Lieutenant Mar Morales to heal. We're going to be going up against the Stitches, though. That's going to make stuff. Right? Zagara pushing Sonya. I mean, like, both really solid teams. So this is going to be a heck of a good time we're going to have here. Um, hmm. Normally, I would take... Wow, what do I want to take here? This is... Normally, I'd take, like, Lost Soul or Barbed Shot for the uh, purposes of taking uh, Mercenary Camps. But I kind of don't need to do that with Rexar and Gazla on my team. So what I think I'm going to do, I'm going to take Withering Fire. Uh, this is going to increase the range of my my uh, Q, which targets uh, nearby enemies. And I don't have to aim it. It will prioritize whoever's closest to me, but it will prioritize heroes over minions and mercenaries. Nice. So three of us took down. I mean, we did lose. Did we lose anybody? No, actually, I, I was gonna say like, wasn't there a third person down here? But no, there wasn't. It was just me and Rexar versus Stitches. The other team completely dominate or uh, completely uh, just going after the top lane. Although it looks like we've got Abathur down here as well. Oh, Stitches getting me with a good hook. Nicely done by him. That was an excellent hook. Um, we should have the Immortals queuing in here in a second. And our opponents. So we got to get down there and help Rexar out. Hopefully he can grab the fountain. Okay, so that's that. I'm going to come up here and start attacking the opposing team's Immortal. Because, quite frankly, that is what I am exceptional at. The other team is going to defend, but I don't know how much it's going to matter here. So this is really nice. Like, I don't have to... Get rid of Abathur's Mines. Uh, I'm going to double the amount of stun. Basically, the uh, minions and whatnot are going to be stunned for two seconds instead of one. It'll help with a lot of different things here. And yes, we have a pretty good run there. I was going to think about it. Like, I'm actually going to come up here. It looks like the rest of my team is going to go down. I'm going to go up top. Or is Gazla going up top? Okay, only one of us needs to go top. So it looks like Gazla has got it. So I'm going to come down here. Uh, running into Abathur landmines. So this is great. I can do this, and it'll it'll stun the towers so that they won't attack us, which will make our immortal a little more survivable. I've got the uh, fortress there.
We're gonna just keep pushing. This is actually, a, you know what, like, normally when I do this, like, Sylvanas always goes in the other direction, but I decided to come down here because Gazla was going top. See, so I'm going to take this, give myself a little bit of sustain here. Actually, now that I think about it, we've got Morales. That was kind of unnecessary. But uh, basically what's going to happen is every time the Black Dagger does damage and it spreads to somebody, I'm going to get some health back. We are going to get stitches there. You can see, uh... I need more mana. I'm here. Lovely work. I need to go back. I'm out of mana. I... Th Rexar is going to be just fine taking that camp by himself. And Morales is going down there to help out, so that's going to be even better. This is a fine job. I'm going to come up here and give Gazlo a hand. Oh, he's got Zagara on him. That's never a good thing. Oh, Zagara and some mercenaries. Let's see if I can't pitch in here. Let's see what happens if we come up here. Enemy team is absent. Gaslow's pitching in. Nicely done. And we're going to have these guys down in a couple of seconds. Then I'll put them out. And then I'm going to come down here and grab this fella. If Arthas, if Arthas stays with Gaslow. We approach your position. So everything is stunned right now. I'm liking that. And I am going for Forward. nicely done. Okay, the other team is certainly putting a hurt on the immortal, so we are going to need to get in there and take theirs out. Yeah, the, the one fault I would say to uh, Sylvanas is she's a very mana intensive hero. And, you know, again, not a lot of health here. <laughs> not what you would call a huge health pool. Although, I mean, like, you can look at the damage with me just sweeping in. Like, everybody helps, but, like, I just sweeping in and hitting. The Immortal, he is down quite a bit. The rest of the team looks like they're going to be able to come in here and easily mop up. Although, Gazlo and I are both down. The enemy team is certainly pushing for it. All the mercenaries have been killed, which doesn't help anybody. They're going after Morales. Um, the Immortal is down. Now, Rexar can save Morales from stitches. And he is going to hit in there. I have back. I need to get in there. I'm going to come up here to the top. I think by the time I get to the middle, the fight will have pushed on to somewhere else. I gotta say, like, I said, like, earlier, like, normally when I, whenever I see other people play, this is my first time playing Sylvanas on this map. 
So, like, I was unaware of um, how really good at this she is. Uh, her ability to help the immortal push by taking out the tower. Ability to defend, because a lot of the damage to the immortal comes from the towers. I mean, like, you can see, like, with the tower not attacking him, he is staying up a lot longer. I'm going to take uh, Black Arrow Slows Heroes. And then we are getting out of here. <laughs> Arthur's pushing deep. My will is my own. See if we can't take this camp out from under him. Oh, that's awesome. Let's see if I can't get down here. I think that's going to have passed by the time I get to where the opposing team is. But Oh, that was a lovely use of stim, stim patch. Stitches is going to get away from me. Sonya's going to come up and play, though. That's nice of her. Let that go through and slow everybody up a little bit. I'm going to bail out. Because I need to... Ah, I'm going to run right into a land. Gate back. I need health. You and all your servants in hell will cower before so, me. nice play, though. Like I think the team's doing really well. Let's see. Although... Okay, yeah, Mar I was going to say, it looks like Morales is going on. No, Arthas is already there. Morales, Morales and Arthas. Ooh, we're going to stim pack Arthas. Uh, I, I will say, like, I think the nastiest thing I have seen in this game with the stim pack is uh, Tychus stim pack with blood rage off of um, uh, off of uh, Rhaegar, uh, because apparently those effects stack, and he's just wrong. One dead cigar. I am awesomely okay with that. I think the thing I do. There's a talent I was taking for a while, and I wanted to make sure I didn't take it again. Where uh, every time I use an ability, my next attack does extra damage. And uh, it's a great ability on some characters, but for me and Sylvanas, not so much because. It's, I uh, I tend to uh, rapid fire everything. All right, let's get over there and help the immortal. some fun here. Uh, 
I was probably meant to use that on the other team, I'll be really honest. Ooh, lovely. I don't know what stitches missed me with. I can't imagine I was out I was too far away for him. But it looks like we're gonna get this here. Alright. What a nice game. Uh I'm gonna say like I playing Solanus on this with having her back the immortal where you can shut down the towers is just gross and wrong and horrible but a welcome addition to things i can do today <laughs> so uh thank you folks for joining me i hope you enjoyed the match i thought it was a pretty decent one a lot of fun there and i think it went pretty well uh let's check and see how we did overall uh high end to kill actually not a okay the other team only got five kills but not a hugely high end game there uh, siege damage, decent. Uh, Gaslow beat me, but then I expected that. Uh, hero damage, not great. Solanus isn't so great against heroes, I don't think. I might be wrong about that. I'm just getting used to her now, but her siege damage is really good. Is, is one of the high end there. Uh, nice XP contribution, too, though. So, all right, folks. Thank you for joining me. Uh, I do appreciate you tuning in. You guys have a great day. I'll see you all next time.